Abbas has called on the government to enhance monitoring and enforcement to prevent businesses from unjustly raising prices after the removal of blanket subsidies for diesel. In a statement last night, past Secretary General Takyudin Hassan welcomed the government's goal of improving financial sustainability and addressing subsidy leakages. However, he expressed concerns about the potential negative impact on the public. He said past hopes that the target groups, such as producers, transport services, farmers, low-income groups and other will be fully covered under the exemption measures provided through an easily accessible registration process. He added that PASS also hopes the government will enhance domestic monitoring and enforcement roles to prevent those who take advantage of raising prices or manipulating the market. He stressed the need for proactive enforcement to ensure the measures are effective and to address any inefficiencies swiftly. The statement came following the government's decision to eliminate blanket diesel subsidies starting today. The government has initiated a 200 ringgit monthly allowance for eligible private users as a substitute for the removed subsidies. Specific subsidy initiatives have also been introduced for the agriculture, fishing, logistics and public transportation sectors. The government has stated that with these sectors covered, businesses should not increase prices by citing higher diesel costs.